Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Math with Mrs. O. Today's lesson is on work problems. Problem number one. Paolo can paint a room in three hours, while Don can do the same job in five hours. How long will it take both of them working together to do the job? Okay, so step number one. We let X be the number of hours it will take both of them to finish painting a room if they work together. So I suggest that you come up here with a table for both. You fill up the table about the work done, which is one work, the rate, and the time. It says here, you let X be the number of hours it will take both. So, both, this is your time X, your rate is 1 over X. Then, go back to the problem. It says here that Paolo can paint a room in 3 hours. So, we fill this up for Paolo. The time of Paolo is 3 hours. These are all in hours. While Don can do the same job in five hours. So we make another column or row for Don. This is five hours. So the rate of Paolo is one over three. What does it mean? It means that Paolo can finish one third of the job per hour, or one work in three hours. What about the rate of Don? The rate of Don will be one-fifth, meaning Don can finish one-fifth of the work per hour, or one work in five hours. Now, the problem is how long will it take both, this is both, of them working together to do the job? So we have here, uh, this is one word for all. So the rate of Paolo plus uh, the rate of both, rather, the rate of both equals the rate of Paolo, which is one third. So the rate of both is one over x equals the rate of Paolo, which is one third, plus the rate of Don which is one-fifth there. Then, we solve for x. If you have um, fractions like this, the best thing to do is to remove all the denominators. How do we do that? By multiplying everything by the LCD. What is the LCD here? Of 3, 5, and x, we have Yes, 15x. So we multiply everything by 15x and this by 15x. So 15x times 1 over x, the x will cancel. You're left with 15. 15x times 1 third, that gives you 15 divided by 3. Or, okay, I'll just do it step by step so that everybody can understand. Plus... 15x times 1 fifth, or 1 fifth times 15x, there. So, 15 divided by 3 gives us a 5. So, we are now left with 15 equals 5x plus 15 divided by 5 is 3. 1 times 3 times x is 3x, which is now 8x. So, 15 is equal to 8x. We divide both sides by 8 there. So this gives us an x which is 15 over 8 hours. Or 15 eighths can be written as a mixed number. So you have 1, 15 minus 8 is 7. 1 and 7, 7 over 8 hours. This is the final answer.
Now, let's move on to problem number two. Nards and urns working together can repair a cabinet in eight days. Urns can do thrice as much work as nards. How long will it take nards to do the job alone? Okay, so we let n be the number of days nards can repair the cabinet alone. So, uh, if you will have here a table again for the work done, the rate, and the time, so we'll have the following. For nards, let's read this again. We let n be the number of days nards can repair the cabinet alone. So nards, nards time is n. His rate is 1 over n, meaning 1 work in n days. Days, let's specify this as days. This is 1 work. Earns for earns. We have one word also, and we let E be the number of days urns can repair the cabinet alone. So we let this be E days, and the rate is now 1 over E. There. So, let's uh, read the problem again. Nards and urns working together can repair a cabinet in 8 days. 8 days. So, the rate of nards plus the rate of urns will be 1 over 8. Remember, both can repair the cabinet in 8 days. So, both will have a rate of 1 over 8. Let's move to the next equation. Urns can do thrice as much work as nards. This means that that the rate of earns is thrice as much work as nards is now three times the rate of nards. There you go. So, if we simplify this, we have here 1 over n plus 1 over e is equal to 1 over 8. And we can rewrite this as 3 over n, 3 times 1 over n, minus, you can transpose 1 over e to the other side, minus 1 over e is equal to, when you transpose that, this one is 0. Then you can now use elimination by addition, as you can see, what happens to this too? 1 over e minus 1 over e gives you a 0. Plus 1 over n plus 3 over n is 4 over n is equal to 1 over 8. There. So now, So we have here 4 over n plus 0 equals 1 over 8. 4 over n plus 0 equals 1 over 8. This was the last equation that we had there. So plus 0, so 4 over n equals 1 over 8. Cross multiply, n times 1 is equal to n equals 4 times 8 is equal to 32. There. So N, which is Nards, so Nards can repair the cabinet alone in 32 days. There. So Nards can, can repair the cabinet alone in 32 days. Before we end, let us always remember to add kindness, subtract judgment, multiply understanding, equals Mrs. O's Good Life Equation. Don't forget to subscribe, click the subscribe button. Thank you.